what's going on, Geminis. Thank you to everyone that's like, shared, subscribed. If you guys have purchased a reading or donated to my page. Thank you. I appreciate you guys. <clears throat> if you have not subscribed, please do so that you know when I have new content. Okay? Um, if the reading resonates with you, please hit me with the like button. Okay? I, I appreciate it. So keep me in the res uh, in, in the uh, mix of videos. In that algorithm that YouTube has going on here. All right, this energy could be masculine or feminine, so just place it on whatever side, you know. I don't care which side you need to put it on. That's up to you. You know about that. I don't, okay? Um, I'm just going to tell you who's in your energy right now, who's pulling on you, my loves, okay? Just give me a moment. Somebody that, that feels like their shadow side is so strong, like they're still in a whole bunch of bullshit. So in other words, there's a lot going on that you don't know about. Okay, Spirit said that's it. Okay. There's a lot going on that you don't know about. You would not understand what's going on in this person's side, uh, a life, right? What's going on the, on the side, that shadow side of them. Um, they're keeping secrets, right? This person knows that they're not worthy of you because they do keep secrets from you. Whoever this person is, um, is pulling on your energy. Um, I belong to you even while I'm with them. So this is a person that is not currently in a relationship with you or in a union with you. And even if they say that they're in a relationship with you, they're actually with someone else. There are some things going on that you would not understand. I'm sorry. Okay. So they got themselves in some sort of situation. Okay. Now I just got to keep it a buck with y'all. Uh, when this card came up, there's some things going on that you would not understand. I'm feeling like either someone is dealing with a baby mama, baby father, trying to hold the peace, right? Giving them what they want, no matter what that is. Um, trying to hold the peace around a child. For others of you, um, I have two people trying to come to terms with a relationship having to deal with something having to do with real estate so in other words yeah i give them a little bit or i give her a little bit here and there so she don't come at me about the rent or or the mortgage or whatever stuff of that nature is what i'm feeling okay and if someone is dealing with someone and if this they know that that person cares about them they're not going to tell you about that because they know that you're not going to rock with that shit. You're not even going to understand it. Like, what type of shit is this that you're telling me about that you're doing? Like, what is wrong with you? It's what I'm feeling. Like, what? What you say? Like, what? This is what you're doing? Like, for real? Yep. So, I feel like either you ended the cycle with this person, right? Intuitively, you knew that something was going on. The cycle may have ended, right? You may have been uh, feeling like this person was keeping those secrets, right? That moon energy is that cycles, visions, dreams. You also could have been having dreams uh, telling you what this person was doing on the back inside because you are very intuitive, right? And your dreams was telling you that, yeah, this person is up to no motherfucking good, like I thought, right? Could have been a, um, a masculine energy of someone that was moving in their masculine energy here. Okay, um, someone here may have needed to to assert their their power, meaning take their power back from a situation. So so either this was a masculine or, or someone moving in masculine energy doing this or someone needed to stand in their masculine energy and assert the power uh, to take back from this. Right. Yep. Someone got the hell out of Dodge. OK, so this is someone that you may have walked away from. Gemini, and if this is not your energy, flip it, okay, and put it on whatever side you need to. Could be someone that you're thinking of, could be someone that's um, in your energy in some way, okay. But I see someone here saying, you know what, I'm I'm done with this shit. I got to get the hell away from you, All right? So someone may have changed homes, they may have relocated, they may have moved on and said, you know, I can't take this anymore, okay. I got to make some changes for myself. All right, so let's see what's going on. Four of Pentacles energy, right? So whoever this is that said, you know what, I'm standing up for myself. I'm not dealing with this anymore. You may be uh, focusing on your own energy, your own money, your own time, your own space. Four of Pentacles energy is that one person is being very cautious of the things that they get themselves into, holding on to money, holding on to things or resources out of fear. This could be someone that has Capricorn in their chart. 
right? Because you just don't want to be bamboozled again. You don't want to deal with people that's trying to fuck you over. Someone here may be happily single. Um, you may have recently had a child with someone or someone could be telling you that they're pregnant around you. Uh, for That's not going to resonate with everyone. Uh, but you're financially independent or you're working on your financial independence here. You're minding your business. You're doing what you need to do uh, to be okay. Okay, this is Virgo energy, right? You, you like that you're free too from this person. Um, you may not have liked how you got your freedom, but you do like that you're free and you're able to do the things that you needed to do uh, or do for your life, right? Receptive energy is here. Intuitive energy is here, right? So you may have known what was going on. The sun card is in reverse, my loves. Okay, right? Things were not being illuminated that you needed to be illuminated from this person or by this person. So they weren't letting you in on them secrets that they have. And that's a big problem here. If you love me, right, I can tell that you're not telling me everything. I can tell that you're not keeping under the buck with, you, with me. Why are you doing that shit? Okay? Why? Why would you treat me like that? I don't understand, right? This is the energy coming from someone here. Okay? So it caused someone here to jump to conclusions, maybe. Um, you know, there was a lot of improvements that needed to be done in this relationship, situationship. But basically, it was weak because, you know, people were not coming to terms uh, with what needed to be done. There was no hope, right? Someone may have felt like the other person stuck. You know, they were stuck, like, I'm stuck here. Like, And you would feel like that if you're in a relationship, you're not getting along with someone and you have a child with them. Okay. Uh, yeah, I'm stuck because I got to deal with this person no matter what, because we have a kid. Okay. And I'm feeling like that energy is coming through. And it could have been also real estate for someone here that, that stuck them to someone else. So they, some sort of obligation, some sort of res responsibility here. Um, however, someone felt that someone was not keeping it a buck behind their back. There was no growth, no, no prosperity. There was no um, happiness in this union. Right. So the cycle ended. Okay, the cycle ended with this person. Okay, and now this is a person that's pulling on your energy. Okay, they're saying, Hey, I do belong to you, I do uh, want to belong to you, but I'm with them, you know. And even though I'm with them, I still could belong to you, I still in my mind belong to you because I can't tell you about this shit or tell you why I gotta do what I gotta do. Nine of Cups, this person is looking at you now and saying, Hey. You know, uh, I, I see how you fulfilled me. I see, you know, how you were a wish come true in certain ways. How, you know, you tried to make me happy. You know, how you tried to give me good sex, good love, and how you tried to pamper me. This is Pisces energy, right? But this person has so many secrets that someone said, you know, I fucking let go. Someone ended up walking away, right? Death and rebirth is here, as I said, walking away, okay? Scorpio energy is here. Someone said, you know what? This shit has to die or my thoughts on it have to die or the way that I feel about it has to die so that I can have something new in my life. And it means that I have to end this so that I could go over here so that I could do what I need to do. That's what the hell I'm going to do. All right. This is what someone did. Someone said, I, I can't deal with this anymore. My life is transforming and I would like for, you know, me to enjoy that transformation. And up to now, I haven't enjoyed anything. I've been stuck with you. We were miserable, both of us. And this is just not working. Okay. So this is the person that's in your energy. Gemini's. I'm sending you guys love and light. You guys take care.